Thank you very much for clicking this video. No matter what you want to be, it may be web developer, it may be software developer or a game developer. You have to learn code. If you follow some tricks, learning code can be fun. In this video, I am going to explain how you can learn code effectively. So if you are interested, keep watching. Here I will give you five tips if you are interested to learn code effectively. So let's begin. Before going to start this video, I have a request. If you are new in this channel, please check out my other videos. And if you think my videos are helpful, don't forget to click the subscribe button. Number one, active learning versus passive learning. The first thing you should learn code actively, not passively. Learning code and watching movies or music videos are not the same. When you watch a movie or a music video, in that case, you don't need to do anything. You just enjoy. But learning code is not the thing you just need to enjoy. Like while a instructor trying to code something, you should also try to code. When a instructor explains something, you should also follow the things and try to implement those tips and tricks on your next project. Lots of students watch what instructor shares and then they procrastinate. They don't do anything. If you do that, in that case, your learning will not sustainable. So always try to learn code actively, not passively. Number two, take breaks. Suppose you want to learn code and it may be a bootstrap code. In that case, you purchased a course from Udemy. By the way, I have a course on Udemy about Bootstrap. You can check out that course where I actually explained every single thing how Bootstrap work and create some project with it. Suppose you want to learn Bootstrap and it's a 10 hour course. You decided you will complete this course in one day. Definitely, if you try, you can do it. But it will be horrible experience for you. Also, how much you learned, it will not sustainable. The reason because you absorbed everything in a day. So if you're interested to learn code effectively and also faster, it doesn't mean you can do it in one day or you should do it in one day. In that case, you should learn and then take break, again learn, again take break. It should be your goal. For me, I learn for one hour and I take rest for 10 minutes to 15 minutes. This is the effective way to learn as well as understand the code properly. Number three. Take notes while learning. You should take notes while learning. You can take notes on paper or on digital notes like Notion, Google Keep, Evernote notes and so on. While instructors share their experience, in that case, they will teach you something and you might not get it. You might face some issue. You might feel that it's a bit complicated. In that case, if you take note, it will help you a lot. Otherwise, when you want to create a project, if you stack, this note can be helpful. So I highly recommend you to take note. It will be time saver and also it will help you to understand the code properly. Number four, keep tracking. Suppose you want to learn JavaScript and you started learning. After a while, you don't know how far you have come. In that case, tracking can be helpful for you. If you don't track your learning, you will be a loop. All time you will feel you need to learn more. Just by completing a course or a book, you will not learn everything. So you will always feel you need to learn more and then you will start learning from another resource. But it's not effective. I recommend that if you learn a course or if you complete a book, you should try to start some basic project. If you face any issue, search on Google, Stack Overflow or any other resource. That will be a effective learning and you will understand the problem properly. So if you want to learn code effectively, you should track your learning. Number five, rest and recover. Don't forget to take rest. Otherwise, your learning will not effective. So learn, take rest, revise and then recover. This should be your strategy to learn code. If you follow this strategy, I hope learning code journey will be fun. A bonus tips for you. Create project as much as you can. Minimum create five projects if you learn something new. It will give you a solid understanding on that topic. Upload your code on GitHub and share your interviewer. It will help you to get job faster. I hope this video is helpful for you. If you think this video is helpful for you, don't forget to click the like button. And if you think this video is not helpful for you, click the dislike button and let me know why you don't like this. If you are new on this channel, please check out my other videos. And if you think my videos are helpful, don't forget to click the subscribe button and click the bell button next to the subscribe button. So when I will publish a video, you will notify. Thanks for watching. Have a good day and stay safe. I am Ali Hossain signing out.